Welcome to a journey into the future of organizations. Imagine if your organization could think, learn, and adapt just like the human brain. Not as a metaphor, but as a living reality. In our previous episodes, we explored quantum enterprises and the foundations of AI native organizations. Now, we're discovering something even more revolutionary, organizations that actually think. The human brain remains nature's most sophisticated achievement, a network of 86 billion neurons working in perfect harmony, processing information, learning from experience, and adapting to change in real time. For centuries, we've designed organizations like machines, with rigid hierarchies and linear processes. But in today's world of exponential change and complexity, this mechanical approach is breaking down. The Great Awakening let me tell you about Sarah Chen, CEO of a global technology firm that was once the industry standard for success. Two years ago, her company was dying. They had everything that should have spelled success, the best talent, cutting-edge technology, substantial resources, and a strong market position. But something was missing. We were tracking every metric imaginable, Sarah recalls. Revenue was strong, processes were efficient, customer satisfaction was high. Yet we kept being blindsided by market changes. Younger, smaller competitors were adapting faster. Our employees were frustrated. Innovation was slowing. That's when it hit me. We were trying to operate like a machine in a world that demands a brain. Sarah's story echoes across industries. A tech startup in Silicon Valley, despite raising millions in funding, found itself paralyzed by decision bottlenecks. A manufacturing giant with a century of success watched nimbler competitors steal market share. A healthcare provider with state-of-the-art facilities struggled to coordinate patient care effectively. These organizations share a common challenge, they're using industrial age operating systems to navigate information age complexity. But some organizations are breaking free from this paradigm, and their transformations offer a blueprint for the future. The neural revolution The revolution begins with a fundamental shift in how we think about organizations. What makes the human brain remarkable isn't just its processing power, it's its ability to learn, adapt, and evolve. Now, groundbreaking research shows how organizations can develop these same capabilities. Michael Chen's global logistics company offers a perfect example of this transformation. We used to have a single brain, the executive team, Michael explains. Every significant decision had to flow through headquarters. We had regional offices, local teams, and frontline workers, but they were like limbs waiting for instructions from the brain. Then came the supply chain crisis of 2023. Traditional companies were paralyzed, but Michael's organization responded differently. They had just completed their neural transformation, distributing intelligence throughout their network. When disruptions hit, something remarkable happened. Instead of waiting for central command, our local teams began responding instantly, Michael continues. AI systems provided real-time analytics. Teams across different regions coordinated spontaneously. Solutions emerged from unexpected places. We weren't just faster, we were smarter as an organization. The results were stunning. While competitors took weeks to adapt to disruptions, Michael's company responded in hours. They maintained 98% delivery reliability during the crisis, captured market share, and emerged stronger than ever. The four pillars of neural design This transformation isn't magic, it's based on four fundamental pillars that mirror how the brain functions. Let's explore each one in detail. First pillar. Distributed intelligence Just as the brain distributes intelligence across neural networks, organizations must spread intelligence throughout their system. Dr. Lisa Rodriguez, who studies neural systems, explains. The magic happens when you combine human intuition, AI capabilities, and organizational knowledge into a seamless network. Consider how this works in practice. A global retail bank restructured its operations around intelligence nodes, small, cross-functional teams with decision-making autonomy. Each node combines local market expertise AI-powered analytics direct customer feedback operational capabilities resource control. These nodes don't just execute instructions, they sense, 
think, and act. When a new competitor entered one of their markets, the local node spotted the threat, analyzed the impact, and developed a response strategy within days. In the old model, this would have taken months of committee meetings and approval cycles. Second pillar. Adaptive architecture Your organization's structure should be as fluid as your thoughts. Traditional hierarchies give way to dynamic networks that reshape themselves based on changing needs. The healthcare industry provides a compelling example. A major hospital network redesigned itself around patient journeys rather than departments. Teams form and reform based on patient needs, combining different specialties, support staff, and resources as required. I-Systems help coordinate these fluid teams, ensuring seamless care delivery. The results are remarkable. Treatment planning time reduced by 60% patient satisfaction increased by 45% care coordination errors dropped by 80% staff engagement scores reached all-time highs third pillar. Collective learning systems in the brain. Every experience strengthens neural pathways and creates new connections. Neural organizations work the same way. Every experience makes the entire system smarter. A global manufacturing company revolutionized its approach to learning. Instead of traditional training programs and knowledge management systems, they created what they call a living knowledge network. Here's how it works. AI systems capture insights from daily operations cross-functional teams share discoveries in real-time successful solutions are instantly available across the organization failed experiments become valuable learning opportunities knowledge flows freely across geographical and departmental boundaries when a team in Singapore solved a complex production problem, teams in Mexico and Germany implemented the solution within hours. Traditional organizations would have taken months to share this knowledge, if they shared it at all. Fourth pillar. Dynamic integration different parts of the brain work in harmony, sharing information and coordinating responses. Neural organizations achieve the same seamless integration across functions and divisions. A technology company eliminated traditional departmental silos by creating what they call integration spaces, physical and virtual environments where different parts of the organization naturally collaborate. Marketing insights instantly inform product development. Customer service feedback immediately shapes feature priorities. Supply chain data automatically influences production schedules. Transformation in action Let's look at three organizations that have successfully implemented neural design principles. Healthcare transformation. Memorial Health System Memorial Health faced a crisis in their emergency department, long wait times, overwhelmed staff, and declining patient outcomes. Instead of adding more resources or optimizing processes, they fundamentally reimagined their operation as a neural network. They created rapid response teams that form instantly based on patient needs AI-powered triage systems that predict patient flow real-time resource allocation systems cross-functional care teams with decision-making authority continuous learning loops that improve protocols daily the results transformed their operation. Average wait times dropped by 65% patient outcomes improved by 40% staff satisfaction increased by 50% costs decreased by 25% retail revolution. Global Mart Global Mart struggled with inventory management and customer satisfaction. Their transformation into a neural organization revolutionized their business model. They developed Predictive inventory systems that learn from multiple data sources local store teams empowered to make real-time decisions dynamic pricing that adapts to local conditions integrated online offline experiences continuous customer feedback loops the impact was dramatic. Inventory costs reduced by 30% sales increased by 25% customer satisfaction reached industry-leading levels market share grew in every region manufacturing miracle. Advanced Products Inc. A traditional manufacturer transformed rigid production lines into flexible, intelligent networks. Their neural organization features adaptive production cells that reconfigure based on demand AI-powered quality control systems cross-trained teams that shift with production needs real-time supply chain integration continuous improvement networks the transformation delivered.
40% improvement in productivity 60% reduction in defects 50% faster new product introduction 35% cost reduction practical implementation guide building a neural organization isn't about throwing out everything you know. It's about evolving what you already have through a systematic approach. Step 1. Start small begin with pilot, neural nodes, teams empowered to sense and respond to local conditions. Give them clear decision rights access to data and AI tools resources to act quickly freedom to experiment connection to other nodes step 2. Build connections develop robust information pathways between nodes. Implement real-time communication systems create collaboration spaces establish data sharing protocols enable cross-functional projects foster informal networks step 3. Foster learning implement feedback loops that accelerate organizational learning. Capture insights systematically share successes and failures. Enable rapid experimentation recognize and reward learning make knowledge easily accessible step 4. Scale gradually expand based on results and learning. Monitor pilot program outcomes adjust based on feedback train other areas in neural principles build support systems celebrate and share successes the future is neural the organizations that thrive tomorrow won't be the ones with the most resources or the latest technology. They'll be the ones that learn to think. We're seeing this reality unfold across industries. Technology companies becoming more human-centric manufacturing becoming more adaptive healthcare becoming more integrated retail becoming more intuitive services becoming more responsive next week. We'll explore how to build quantum teams that can operate within these neural organizations. For now, consider this. Is your organization ready to evolve from a machine to a brain? The future belongs to organizations that think. The only question is, will yours be one of them? Production notes visual elements open with brain scan transitioning to organizational network use dynamic 3D visualizations of neural networks show real world examples of transformed organizations include clear before, after comparisons display data visualization of improved outcomes and with inspiring montage of neural organizations in action music and sound opening. Inspiring, forward looking theme main content. Subtle, driving background closing. Building to emotional peak graphics clean, modern look neural network motif throughout. Clear data visualizations journey maps transformation timelines pricing dynamic but clear pause for key insights build tension for revelations allow breathing room for complex concepts.